Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. I wanted to do my November favorites this month. Um, I haven't done a favorites video in a long time. And so this month I've just been trying a lot of different things and I just wanted to talk about it. Um, okay, one of the things that I've really been loving this month is just wearing um, a lighter eyeshadow, like a more natural eyeshadow look with dark lips, either dark lips or pink lips, but I'll show you that after. So one of the palettes that I've been reaching for quite a bit is my Naked 2 palette. It's broken because I dropped it on the floor so it doesn't close shut anymore. But I've been going in with a lot of, um, I don't know, just not so much the darker colors in there, but more like the golds and these two colors here. Not so much um, the silver and the purples and blacks and stuff like that, or the, yeah, not so much that, but more the natural one. And um, before putting this on, actually I should have started with this, but that's all right. The other thing that I've really been liking is the um, Maybelline Color Tattoo in Too Cool. It's just this white color. I just put the white all over my lid um, before I put the shadow on, just so that the colors can be pop a little bit more. I'm actually wearing um, this palette and this color on my lid today. So um, the next thing that I have really been loving is the Maybelline Fit Me blush, and mine is in the color, um, I think, I'm not sure if the name is blush, well, in little letters here it says blush, but then up here it says 50H402. Oh, medium nude, haha, <laughs> sorry, it says right here medium nude. So when you go in with your finger, it actually doesn't look very, like it doesn't look like anything, but found a little trick that I've been using for a while. I got this Pure, um, I think it's called Pure, P-U-R, this brush for some uh, mineral foundation and I don't think I even ever use the foundation but I got this brush and because it's so stiff this brush is perfect in here when you dip this in there it gets a lot of product on here and you can just apply it to the cheeks I don't think no I'm not wearing this blush today but usually this is the blush that I've been wearing lately and then I'll take a little bit of the NYX blush this NYX blush is in the color stone take that and put it like up here at the top of my cheeks so um, that's what I've really been loving for my cheeks. My foundation, okay, so I'm wearing Bare Minerals foundation today. I usually wear Bare Minerals foundation unless I'm going out or I just want to just have a more like covered look. Um, but when I wear my regular foundation, I wear the Lancome Tint Adult Ultra, I think is how you pronounce it. So I love this foundation because, you know, my skin's really oily and this foundation is amazing for oily skin. I just love it. Um, okay, okay, my favorite um, eyeliner product, which I'm wearing right now, is the Bobbi Brown um, Long Wear Gel Eyeliner in the color Caviar Ink. So yeah, that's the eyeliner that I'm wearing on my lids. I love it. I just love putting it on and winging it out, and I just think that it's gorgeous. It's my favorite eyeliner right now. Okay, and then lastly my favorite lip products. I guess I'll go ahead and get started with the lip stains that I picked up recently. Uh, well, one of them I've had for a while, but I just started wearing it recently. It's the um, Champagne Lip Stain by NYC. It's this one here. I'm actually wearing it on my lips right now. And I have a little bit of the e.l.f. glitter gloss over top. So I've been loving that on my lips. And then I also got um, one in Persistent Pink. And then the other color that I got is Never Ending Nude. And this one's a lot darker than I thought. I guess I thought that by the name Never Ending Nude, it would be more of a, like a nudie color, but I don't know what would be the point of making a lip stain if it was gonna be like a nude color, like the color of your lips. Um, and then lastly is the MAC um, lipstick in the color Cream Cup. Oh, I just love this. It's this really pretty pink color that looks like that. And it is so beautiful. I did a little swatcheroo in my hand in my other video. Um, so I really want to get on and do a tutorial soon, but my I just have so much unpacking to do. So I need to like find a time where I can make a couple minutes to just come on and put some of these products on so that you can see. Maybe I'll try to do that this weekend. Um, but anyway, yeah, those are the things that I have just been loving this week. Um, uh, oh, and <laughs> I am also loving um, the Taylor Swift CD. Hello, have you heard the new Taylor Swift CD? I think that it's, I just love it. I love it, love it, love it, love it. I've been playing it over and over and over again. 
Um, so I've been loving that, and I've also been loving my new hair. Love, love, love my new hair. Uh, I guess I keep referring to it as my new hair because I got the smoothing treatment. Um, I just threw my hair back today because I went out last night with my cousin, and I woke up a little bit late this morning, but I really wanted to film a video, so I just threw it all back. But um, the smoothing treatment really just tames the curls and um, lets your hair relax quite a bit. So I will... Um, show you that too when I have some more time to actually do a longer video. Um, so anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have an awesome week.